everyone here we are going to continue with exercise 9.1 of the chapter direct and inverse variation which was based on the questions of direct variation we have already did till question number 7 in our previous video now let's do question number 8 in question number 8 we are having in a model of a ship the mast is 6 cm high while the mast of the actual ship is 9 meter high if the length of the ship is 33 meter how long is the model of the ship so here we are having the model length and the actual length for the model the flag is of 6 cm and in actual it is of 9 meter now we have to find the length of the model of the ship whereas the actual length of the ship is 33 meter so here this will be also a direct variation so we are going to put the arrow in this direction so here also it will be in this direction only so this can be written as x upon 6 equals to 33 upon 9 here we have put the numerator which was in the arrowhead position now we are going to solve for x and this will be equals to x equals to 3 3 upon 9 into 6 here 3 2 times and 3 3 times 3 11 times and here x equals to 22 centimeter as the answer which will be the length of model of a ship now let's see question number 9 and here in this question we are having the mass of an aluminium rod varies directly with its length if a 16 centimeter long rod has the mass of 192 gram find the length of the rod whose mass is 105 gram now here in this question we are having the mass and the length of the aluminium rod here when the mass was 192 gram the length is 16 meter now if the mass is 105 gram we have to find the length now here we are going to put this in this direction because this one is smaller this one is greater and this will also be in this direction as this was in a direct variation now we can write this one for x and this will be written as 192 upon 105 equals to 16 upon x now we are going to do the cross multiplication and x into 192 equals to 16 into 105 and here x will be equals to 16 into 105 upon 192 now 16 12 times and then 3 4 times and this will be 3 and 5 now x will be equals to 32 8.75 meter as the length of rod now let's do question number 10 here in this question we are having the anita has to drive from village a to village b she measures a distance of 3.5 centimeter between these two villages on the map what is the actual length between the villages if the map scale is 1 centimeter equals to 20 kilometers now here in this question we are having the scale of 1 centimeter equals to 20 kilometer and we have to find the length of 3.5 centimeter which was on map as the actual length we have taken as x now this is also a direct variation we are going to put arrow in this direction because this is only greater than this similarly there also we will be getting a arrow in the downward direction now this can be written as 3.5 upon 1 equals to x upon 20 now we are going to do the cross multiplication and here x will be equal to 3.5 into 20 that is x equals to 70 kilometers as answer now let's do question number 11 here in this question we are having a 23 meter 75 centimeter high water tank cast a shadow of 20 meter long find at the same time the length of the shadow cast by a tree that is 9 meter and 50 centimeter high now here in the first part we have been given with the actual length of the water tank as 23 meter and 75 centimeter which is costing a shadow of 20 meter now this can be written as 23.75 meter and we have to find the shadow which is cast by a tree which is 9 meter and 50 centimeter long so let the length of shadow be x and here this can be written as 9.50 meter now 
Here we see that this one is greater, this one is smaller. So we will put the arrow in this direction and this will also be in this direction only as this is a direct proportion. Now we are going to solve for x and this can be written as 23.75 upon 9.50 equals to 20 upon x. Now we'll do the cross multiplication and on doing so this will be x into 23.75 equals to 20 into 9.50 and here x will be equals to 20 into 9.50 upon 23.75 and now solving this will we get the value of x as 8 meter so the length of the shadow cast by a tree is 8 meter now we'll be doing the second part in which the height of the tree is to be calculated if the length of the shadow is 12 meter. Now here in the second part we are again been given with the same relation for the tank and we have to find the actual length of the tree which is having a shadow of 12 meter. Now here we can see this is a direct variation only so we are going to put the arrow in this one as this one is greater similarly this will also be upper direction only. Now we can write this one as 23.75 upon x equals to 20 upon 12. Now do the cross multiplication and this will be equals to 23.75 into 12 equals to 20 into x. Therefore x equals to 23.75 into 12 upon 20. And on solving this for x we will be getting 14.25 meter. This can also be written as 14 meter and 25 centimeter as answer. Now we are going with question number 12 and here in this question we are having if 5 men or 7 women can earn 525 rupees per day how long would 10 men and 13 women will earn per day. Now here in this question we are having two cases one for the men and other for the women. In the question it has been given 5 men or 7 women they earns 525 rupees per day and now we have to find the total of 10 men and 13 women. So first of all we are going to find the earning of the 10 men and 13 women then we are going to add them. So very first of all we can see that this is a case of direct variation only because as many men will be there the earning will be increased. Similarly in the case of the women too we are going to put the arrow in this direction because this one is greater. Now we are going to solve for x and this will be written as 10 upon 5 equals to x upon 5 to 5. Now we can solve it and here we get 2 over m then do the cross multiplication and this will be x equals to 5 to 5 into 2 that is x equals to 1050 as the earning of 10 men's. Now for the women's here we can write this one as 13 upon 7 equals to y upon 5 to 5. Now we will do the cross multiplication and here y into 7 equals to 5 to 5 into 13. So y equals to 5 to 5 into 13 upon 7. Now 7, 7 and 5 times. So y equals to 975 rupees as the earning of 30 women. Now the total of 10 men and 13 women equals to 1050 plus 975 that is equals to rupees 2025 as answer. That's all in this video. Thank you.